Hey guys, just wanted to give you a quick video on my new phone. I got an iPhone, iPhone XR, just launched about a day or two ago. So, upgraded to that from my Samsung S8 that I used to have. So, I just wanted to test the video quality and, you know, pretty much just give you a quick little update of what's in the storage unit. Um, it's dwindled down. These are going to be coming home pretty soon. Uh, these are some machines I want to do some videos of here pretty soon. So, this is another Hoover uh, power drive. Just needs a few parts, but I got a parts machine at home. Needs a bag door, but I got one at home. I mean, it doesn't color match, but at least we'll get this machine up and running. The one at home, I have two of those tan ones, you may recall, for those of you who have watched my videos. But the other one will not recline back. So that's going to be my parts donor machine. I got this one for free a while ago back. Let's see, Dirt Devil Platinum Force. I haven't really plugged it in much. Um, I think we did it at the vacuum store. I'm not sure. But he just gave it to me. So I don't know if I tested it or if I just took it because it was free. But it's pretty weird that it's got this clear dirt tube. But yeah. That'll be coming home to be used. Uh, my Insight would be coming home because it's just a machine I don't want to leave here. Then the old Eureka. Bring that home. Um, pretty soon this is all going to be out of here. Because uh, it's it's starting to get uh, too costly to keep them here. So I'll bring them home. <laughs> Stuff them all in the basement. Uh, I mean, it wouldn't take too much to get this all closed out and uh, save the money that I'm paying for this unit. That's like 80 something a month. So, do the math. <laughs> That's quite a bit. Um, this is the one I got from my fiance. It's still, I'm going to try to save it, but I don't know if I can. Uh, some of these came from Alex. Majority of these were bought in this storage unit full of vacuums. Um, that was from the vacuum storage unit. This was from the vacuum store. This came from another collector. And then was given to Alex. And then I got it from him. This was trash picked. This cord is actually from a, uh, what was it, the professional series Hoover that he gave me, that Alex gave me. But that insight was trash picked. Um, I don't think any of them in this corner. Well, a correction. This was trash picked from a vacuum shop. Still see, it's got the repair tag. I got it basically for parts if I ever find one, but I doubt I will. Um, but as far as anything else in here, well, that Dirt Devil Swivel Glide was mine years ago, but that came back with me from Michigan. Uh, I traded it to Alex, and then he had to get rid of it, so I brought that back. It's a Hoover throwaway. And by throw away, I mean fold away. There's the Dirt Devil Vive. Uh, Eureka Airspeed Zoom. This is a Dirt Devil Easy Light. These little machines actually aren't that bad. Uh, originally, this was going to be trashed. That's why there's a T scratched into it. Uh, somewhere, I think on this one too, I scratched a T somewhere into it. Yep, right there. That one and that one and this one, just pretty, you know, beat up. Somewhere on this machine, I know I marked it too. Yeah, right there, actually. The teeth still for trash. I was originally going to trash these out, but probably just going to keep them. Um, I do want to eventually get this airspeed right here working. We had one like that at the paint store I used to work at for a while. And it was actually a really nice machine. I liked it. So, see if I can get that working again. Don't know what's really wrong with it. I really haven't tried it. Um, got two wind tunnels. I believe the purple one was missing some parts. This green one's in really good shape. But I'll try to save them both. There's a couple of Smart Vacs in here. There's a couple of Dirt Devil Deluxe MVP style machines. There's one there. There's one there. A whole bunch of brand new chassis for those right there and there. I think there was one more around here, but I don't remember. Oh, yeah, right here. Um, 
I believe this is a new chassis. Uh, or maybe this was one of the used ones I was stripping down. I can't for the life of me remember. That's been a couple of months now. Uh, the Sanitaires and that Eureka came from Alex. Uh, he actually got this one, and I believe, I'm not sure. I know he got this one in Ohio. Uh, this one I got at a mini meet years ago. I gave it to him, and it came back with me again. And I got these little tubes. I don't know why I kept, but they keep falling down. So, yeah, guys, that's uh, pretty much it. There's not much of anything else here to really update you on. So, those are definitely coming home in the next few days. Get some videos up. So, if anything else in here you want to see filmed, as far as if I can get them to work, uh, just let me know down below. I'll see what I can do. Uh, mainly, Bissell is already on the channel, so I really am, I'm not going to record those. Uh, the Smart Vax, refer back a little bit. There was some videos of those on my channel. Um, I know I got some wind tunnel videos up, but I will be willing to do wind tunnel videos. Um, I would be willing, if I can find out if it works, to do a video of the boss back there, the bagged one. Uh, so, pretty much anything else in here, really, minus ones I just listed that I have videos of, of plenty of times, of texting them over the years. Uh, if anything else in here catches your eye, let me know. And I may be pinning against, uh, you know, like a lower-end Bissell against like a higher end vacuum, like one of my nicer Hoovers or Eureka or something like that, I might be willing to do something like that. So, we shall see. Um, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, if you stuck through this whole video, thanks. Uh, I mean, a majority of this was just me rambling on about stuff, but at least it was mainly vacuum stuff. Me and uh, Jordan, uh, a.k.a. Vacuum Guy, uh, the Vec Maxter the Great, I mean. We're actually talking about how we both do so much pointless rambling on in our videos. So, I'm just... If you watch the video all the way through, <laughs> just tell me down below. I'll be curious to see. So, yeah. Without further ado, and without further of me talking, I'll just pan over these one last time. And, uh, conclude the video. Thanks for watching.